All right, guys, looking to do furnace replacement for sure on this unit. It's got a cracked heat exchanger, uh, possibly also looking to do AC, so I will uh, cover that as well. We are uh, in the basement, just right at the bottom of the stairs here. Um, this is all unfinished concrete flooring over where the unit's located. This is a walkout basement, so there's access right from over here, which I believe the front of the house I've got myself turned around here, but I think this is the front of the house and the garage, or excuse me, the driveway kind of pulls back around here, and then you can come through uh, this back, this back area without disturbing anything upstairs. Um, just to note, her husband just went through, I believe, um, either a kidney transplant or kidney surgery, and he's going to be coming home soon, so she's very um, aware and cautious about making sure masks are worn and feet are covered and all that fun stuff, so just be conscious of all that while you're here. Uh, the furnace itself is a 115,000 BTU condensing unit, uh, D-width, 40 inches tall, coils of 4 ton, also D-width. Uh, we've got from the uh, top of the furnace here, oh, let's see, you got 36, 36 and a quarter inches uh, up to that point right there, um, which is all pretty straightforward. Uh, I think one of the reasons for the cranked heat exchanger is we've only got a 16 by 25 one inch filter down there. Uh, also, the return is only a 12 by 25, which it is offset. So the, uh, the return here is actually 31 inches wide. Um, which I don't know why they didn't take advantage of more of that, but it comes down about 28 inches. It's got a got about a six inch offset here to meet up with the furnace, which I'm not sure there's a whole lot we can do to straighten that out. I think we're gonna have to do something similar just because of the way uh, the plenum is set up. Yeah, it looks like this is all, this is all return here. So they cut into the plenum, which is what caused that to have to be offset. It's the humidifier over here. It does have a good shut off on it there. Let's see what they want to do with that. Floor drain right in front of the unit. Uh, we've got uh, two three inch pipes here. It is a concentric set up oh, you can see it there looks to be in pretty good shape so really should all all be pretty standard outside of the fact that this will have to be offset here so and follow the checklist <laughs> 